Hey guys, so I decided to go ahead and do another tutorial. Um, just kind of in the mood to play with my makeup, and this is kind of what I came up with. It's kind of dramatic, lots of purples, um, or purple and some hot pink in there. I really like this look. I kind of wear it a lot, actually. Um, so if this is something that you might want to learn how to do, just stay tuned. Thanks. Start off with my e.l.f. eyelid primer in champagne. I'm just going to apply it all over the lower eyelid area. Take your finger and just kind of smooth it. I take a paddle brush like this and I'm going to be using my sugar pill poison plum just load up your brush get them out start at the lower lash line and start to kind of just smoke it out a little bit and I put it all over the lashes all over the bottom eyelid Kind of a black, very sparkly black from e.l.f. This actually doesn't have a name on it, but yeah. Tap off the brush, it's just on this little kind of a crease brush. We're going to start to apply it right just in the corner of outer corner. Now I'm just going to take my angled eyeshadow brush and I'm just going to kind of blend it out in the crease. A little bit just to kind of soften it. Shadow another sugar pill called Dolly Pop. It's a really bright hot pink color. And a crease. This is a duo fiber crease brush. It's from Crown Brush. Just kind of going to get it on the tip. And then I'm just going to kind of blend out where I put that black with the pink and purple. Don't want to go too high up. Keep it just barely above the crease. Okay. After that, I'm going to go in with a color that's kind of closest to your skin tone. For me, it's going to be this vanilla color. This is actually from Bedhead. I've had it forever, but it blends nicely. And I'm just going to go right underneath the brow bone and kind of blend out that line a little bit from the pink. Just so it kind of softens. The 
actually, it's another sugar pill color. Um, I do not remember the name. It's a sample that I actually got when I placed my order with sugar pill. Um, but I will oops, put it in the drop down bar just so you know. But it is a sugar pill color. And I'm going to be taking this in my little mixing bowl. I'm just going to put a little bit in there with my e.l.f. makeup lock and seal. I'm going to squirt that in a little dish. It's one or two drops. This is just going to help this shadow kind of stick a little bit better. Give it this kind of middly look that I'm going for. Then I'm just going to take it on my, this is just a paddle, kind of like a stiff paddle brush, and I'm just going to be pressing it onto the lid, giving that nice metallic-y, metal -y color. I'm actually going to take it all the way, but I'm going to flip it over. So I can get on that black. Okay. And I'm going to take my paddle brush again with just a little amount of the poison plum again. Tap off the excess for the fallout. And then I'm just going to kind of be... Tapping this in the corner area a little bit and kind of into the crease. Okay. And I'm going to be taking that lock and seal one more time. Make sure you get the same brush that you use to apply that magenta color from Sugar Pill. Make sure you wipe it off really well. And I'm going to be taking this white. It's kind of got like this teal duochrome color to it. It's very pretty. But I'm just going to be taking that and putting it right on the inner corner of my eye. going to take my little flat dome brush again. First I'm going to go in with the dolly paw, or the poison pull, I'm sorry. And I'm going to put it right underneath my lower lash line. Then I'm going to take a I, my eyeliner is from Urban Decay 24-7 in Ransom. It's just a nice purple. And I'm going to line my waterline with that. I can keep a hold of it. It's kind of short. Okay. To go in and with a black, you can do black, you can do plum, you can do really any color you want to, but I want to do black as soon as I find it. And this is my black eyeliner from e.l.f. again. And I'm just going to line the top and like kind of fill in my lash area. Just kind of lift up. Wiggle. It's going to help thicken up the lashes. Okay. Then I'm just going to take my angled 
liner brush and then with that same black color that we used I'm just going to line the tops of my eye get it as close to the lashes it can be just a little thicker because this is kind of a more dramatic look Just all the way across. Then I'm going to be taking, I'm going to get my false lashes now. Um, I really don't know what these lashes are. Just some that I got in the mail with my circle lenses. Once again, you're going to take it and just make sure it's going to line up with your eye. Wiggle it around just a little bit and then you're going to get your eyelash adhesive. With the glue. I have to get kind of close to the mirror so if you see me pop out of frame. That's what I'm doing. Then I'm going to go anything. I'm going to go in with my ginormous lash mascara from Hard Candy. It's supposed to make your eyelashes grow. Go in and kind of blend my natural lashes with these false lashes. Okay. And then for my lips, I used another one in of e.l.f. products. And it's their e.l.f. matte lip color. And this is in coral, I believe. Yes. Line my lips with that. Then I went over that with my e.l.f. glitter gloss in Dazzling Diamond. For the cheeks, I kind of took my blush brush. And I took a little bit of that Poison Plum color. Like, a tap on the Poison Plum, and then I also went through and I tapped on the Dolly Pop, and then just kind of tapped it off, back on the Poison Plum tap, and then just apply it and blend very well. Shake down. Just filled in my eyebrows really good with that. And yeah, so other than that, this is uh, the end. I uh, hope you enjoyed. It's just a nice kind of, if you're going to go out with some friends, kind of more dramatic look. Really like these colors. I, of course, wear them all the time. I really don't care. But yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the tutorial.